عليكم سلام حباب أنت بلا النفوس الكرام عريب العروبة بيت حرام وعرش الشموس حمال لا يضام Mayor, I want to share with you that the flag we're raising today is not the official flag of Syria. However, it is uh, the official flag of our hearts for our homeland. As uh, Syria, as mentioned earlier, as far as we're concerned, is under current occupation by a brutal dictator. The, this flag was adopted in 1932 and it celebrated the independence from France. Uh, this is messages for all the Syrians uh, inside Syria, whether in the areas occupied by the Syrian regime or the areas that are liberated from the Syrian regime. We say we salute you for your resistance and we know that not everyone in Syria has their heart with this brutal regime and we pray to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala that he grants you freedom very soon. In 2011 as part of the Arab Spring the Syrian people wanted the simple right of being able to assemble freely without the threat of force being used against them just like we celebrate here in the United States of America. However that freedom was not granted to them because a brutal dictator who thought it was God's given right for him to continue ruling a land that was given to him by his previously brutal dictator Assad, the father, decided that the only way that he could deal with peaceful protests, and I emphasize peaceful protests because for six months since the start of the Syrian revolution, no one carried arms until they were forced to because men, women, and children were being killed in the streets in cold blood. Women were being raped in prisons and in front of their families. Men and women were being tortured by the thousands. It is a history of that brutal family. Many of us and almost every single one of us has a family member that they don't know where they are right now. Whether it's from 2011 or whether from the first for uprising in 1980. All what they wanted is the freedom to assemble, the freedom to speak freely. However, what they got in return was the destruction of 4,000 schools. The destruction of billions and billions of dollars sometimes entire neighborhoods that you could see clearly on Google Maps now if you look at the map of Syria. That brutal dictator with the help of Russia and Iran is trying to kill the will of the Syrian people. He is owned by Russia and Iran and that is why it is significant to us that we raise the independence flag in hoping of seeing a Syria that is free of Assad in the future. So we thank you for your support. God bless. Assalamu alaikum.